you've heard about using questions, startling statements, and callbacks to begin your speech. And these are each effective. However, my absolute favorite method of opening any presentation is to immediately dive into a story. No thank yous, no hellos, just jump right into it. What happens is a good story creates curiosity in the audience. It makes them sit on the edge of their seats wanting to hear more. Now, like any other type of opening, the story should orient them right into the main point of your presentation. As an example, I often use the following story when I talk about presentation skills and why they're so important in business and to your career and also building your confidence. It was October of 1994 and I was sitting in my boss's office. I was a fairly new financial planner and part of my job at the time was to give financial workshops and seminars in the community. My boss had called me into his office and said, we need to review these evaluations from your last workshop. My first thought was, well, this will be good. And he said, Michael, this is not good. I said, what do you mean, Joe? He said, Look, listen to what people are writing about you. Uh, way too much information. Guy never stands still. Feel like I get hit by a fire hose. Guy talks too fast. Does he ever take a breath? And this went on and on and on. At some point, I stopped Joe and I said, is there anything good in there? He said, well, hmm. Yeah, here's one. Mike has nice hair. My first thought was, did she leave her name and number? Joe looked at me and said four words that literally changed the course of my life, although I didn't know it at the time. Does that kind of opening create some curiosity in you? Would you like to know what the four words were? What happened next? Did I lose my job? How did I overcome my speaking problem? All of that from a quick two-minute story to open a presentation. Now again, what's important about this is that it has to orient and transition into the overall talk about presentation skills and the importance of public speaking. But a quick story can immediately grab interest, keep the audience's attention, and make them want to hear more. Tune in for our tip tomorrow and you'll hear about one bonus idea that will definitely grab the audience's attention before you say a single